Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, northern suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today, we're going to talk about one of the most iconic cars ever built by Cadillac, a 1959 Cadillac Series 62 convertible. Give you all the details in a moment. Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today, we're going to talk about our latest acquisition, and is it a car to be remembered and one of the most famous cars ever produced, in my opinion, that everybody knows, a 1959 Cadillac, which is probably one of the biggest cars in the world at that time, and it's a convertible to boot. We have this right here on our sales floor. You're gonna to wanna to watch this video from start to finish because we're gonna do a walk around, a cold start, give you the, all the details on this really, really remarkable car. And we got some really good paperwork to show you as well. So if you want, you can also click on the link in our description. It'll take you right to our website and this particular car, giving you all the pricing, every other detail of the car, and it'll also let you look at close to 100 classic and collectible vehicles we currently have in inventory at this time. And our website being www.ellingsunmotorcars. Dot com, where we have close to 100 classic and collectible vehicles currently in stock, ranging from cars in the 1920s all the way up into the 70s and beyond. So if you're looking for be it your first collectible or your 100th, we probably have something in stock that you will really, really enjoy. But let's get back to this thing. I'll tell you what, this is what we call a land yacht in my day because a 1959 Cadillac has such a wide hood, beautiful grill work and with all the details in there. I mean, chrome was really paramount in 1959. And take a look <clears throat> at the taillights. Probably the most well-known taillights of any car out of the 50s was the 59 Cadillac with those giant fins, the bullet taillights. I mean, this car looks like it's going down the road already at 100 miles an hour when it's sitting still. But yes, this is one of those cars that we have an incredible amount of history on this car as well. I mean, someone ordered it in Dover White, and of course they came with the standard 390 uh, Cadillac V8 engine, lots of power features as well, numbers matching original motor. You've got power steering, power brakes, you've got power windows, you've got power seat, power top. I mean, Cadillac knew how to make these cars in 1959. And they almost went a little too far with those gigantic tail fins. Some of the Cadillac people kind of went, eh, it's a little ostentatious, but you know what? In this day and age, this is what really, really makes something special. But yes, with all those options, you really need power steering on a car of this magnitude because you're close to 5,000 pounds to going down the road. It's really nice to have power steering for getting in and out of places. I don't know if I'd want to parallel park this car so much, but uh, it's just you know one of those nice features and power brakes. Uh, I guess I always like the wide white walls in these cars. Oh my gosh, I mean, this, this just sets this car off with the full hubcaps with a Cadillac emblem in the middle. Really, really nice. I mean, that's actually, hey, those are Eldorado hubcaps on there. So, you know, for a Series 62, it's just, you know, something that is a little more special, if you will. But beautiful chrome all the way around, beautiful paint. Let's look at the interior on this car. Oh my gosh. This is, uh, we actually have the original paperwork for this car. And this was a special interior with the uh, red leather and uh, the red and white combination. It was a special order. You'll see that right on, as I was suggesting, we have some inter interesting paperwork. Look at this. The original car was delivered new to West Palm Beach, Florida. What a great place to have a car like this then or today for that matter. But the whole car was by the time they got done with taxes and all the options even had air conditioning on it. And that was a four hundred and seventy three dollar option. It was seventy two hundred and fifty four dollars in 1959. Oh, my gosh, that was probably half the price of a new home at that time. 
But yeah, it was really something special and we have all that paperwork going back to when the car was brand spanking new. But yeah, the interior on this car, beautiful dash pad, Odtronic Eye for everyone says, what is that thing in the middle of the dash? Well, I'll tell you what, talk about innovations. This was an automatic headlight dimming device that when you go down a two lane road, <coughs> come onto a car coming at you and they had the high beams on, your car would click to low beam. Funny story with that for me as a kid, we had one on our 57 Oldsmobile. Great out in those country roads going up to Grandma's, which took eight hours riding in a car back then. It, the only problem is when you got into town, if you came into a town that had street lights or whatever, the thing would go click, 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 click. My dad would always shut it off and he'd grumble and say, oh, that thing works, doesn't work in town. But it was a really interesting idea. Nice little extra option on this car. Uh, beautiful dash, like I said, dash pads, beautiful. You got the power windows. Even this is what's really, you know, it's got the little vent windows here. Of course, that was always another one of those things that we really miss in going forward with cars of today because vent windows would always be <clears throat> for someone if they're smoking. Great, great place to flick your ashes and <clears throat> blow the smoke out, whatever. Beautiful, like you say, beautiful interior all the way around. Now look at this. It's got, a, a, the top is a power top, of course, and it's got both boots. Now, when someone says, what do you mean both booths? Well, they have a, a, a cloth booth or a vinyl booth for, you know, just normal. And they have what they call the parade boot, which is a fiberglass thing because a lot of these cars were used in parades. People would want to set the king and queen or the princesses or whatever. You sit on the back on your car, you know, without that hard boot, you can do some damage perhaps to the convertible top. Well, with that hard boot, you avoid all that problems. And there you go. Not, not such a... Uh, thing to worry about and talk about trunk space my goodness you could get three sets of golf clubs in this car or you could smuggle in five people into the drive-in well i guess no one has drive-ins much anymore but at least you can get a few sets of nice clubs in the back so if you want to go to the country club or go out golfing should be something you can think about now you can find all of our stuff on facebook youtube and instagram as well give us a like Leave us a comment or subscribe. We appreciate it very much because we really enjoy having you look at that stuff because it has our current inventory on it. Plus it also has some stuff that we've sold over the years as well. So if you just really like to look at old cars and stories, watch my videos, okay, you can do that. Uh, that's a place that you can do that. Now, you can also come and visit us in person. You know, we just love to have you come down to Ellingson Motor Cars. I mean, we're open to the public Monday through Friday from 10 to 5 and Saturdays 10 to 4. So if you're like me, I want to look at something or need to, you know, see it in person, love to have you come by. It's no, no problem from our standpoint. We really like that, actually. But yeah, it is one of those cars that if you're looking for something that uh, is iconic and you know that you will be the uh, celebrity of any local car show or going to the drive, going to McDonald's and pick up your burger and fries, my goodness, they'd look at this and go, whoa, pretty cool. So if you want to come on down, we'd appreciate it. Well, thanks again for watching and listening to uh, all the information on this uh, newest edition that we have in the 1959 Cadillac Series 62 convertible. We appreciate you watching and thank you again. We'll see you next time at Ellingson Motor Cars right here in Rogers.